All new tonight, a family is celebrating just being alive. It almost wasn't the case. The family of four was hit by a drunk driver in Ellsbury, Missouri. Police later determined his blood alcohol level was more than double the legal limit. News 4's Alexis Sotos learned that this is not the driver's first DUI. It's a road students and families drive every day. This week, many are heading to the basketball tournament at Ellsbury High School. I do not want to go to someone's house and tell them your, your kids aren't coming home. But that could have been the case last night after this crash. A suspected drunk driver smashed into the back of a truck turning into the high school. I think the family's a little sore, but, but they're still alive. It, it could have been a whole lot worse. Had it been a smaller car, I, I think we would have been dealing with something else. The family of four was in a pickup. The other driver was in the minivan. Police arrested him for driving under the influence, saying his BAC was 0 .232. It was not his first, it was multiple. Police tell News 4 the driver has three prior DUIs, but because there are no charges yet in this incident, police are not releasing his name or mugshot. As officers were investigating this DUI accident at Highway B, they got a call about another impaired driver swerving down the road. He was driving erratically and he just, our officer just happened to look up and see the vehicle that fit that description. Two DUIs in one night is unusual for the small town of Ellsbury, but this time of year around the holidays is when the most impaired driving happens. We take DUIs very seriously. Uh, I, you think after this much time when uh, so many DUIs have happened and so many people's lives have been taken that they would not get behind the the wheel, but those who decide that they are going to get behind the wheel, uh, we will find you. In Ellsbury, Alexis Otos, News 4.